spelling list number five. Number one, wait. W-A-I-T, wait. To do something or stay in a place until something expected happens. To wait for the coronavirus to finish. To wait for your turn when you're um, in class. Wait. Number two, wait. W-E-I-G-H-T, wait. The measure of how heavy something is. As you see, these words, these words are homophones. It means it does contain, it does have the same pronunciation, but the spelling and meaning are different. This case, weight means uh, how heavy you are or how much uh, something weights, how heavy it is, weight. Number three, heard, H-E-A-R-D, heard. The past tense and past participle of hear. I heard a noise last night. Number four, heard, H-E-R-D, heard. A group of animals of one kind, such as cattle that stays together or are kept together. Here we have a herd um, of sheep, cattle. It's a cattle sheep. Number five, creek. C R E E K, creek. A small stream of water, often that flows into a river. So it's a small flowing of water. It's not too big. It's not a river, huge river. It's not a lake. This is a stream of water. We have creek, C-R-E-A-K, creek, to make or move with a squeaking sound. When you open the door, probably you have you can hear a, a creak. That's a creak sound. Number seven, heel. H E E L heel. The rounded part of the human foot. On the left, we have a picture of the heel. It's a foot and it has a heel up. And on the right, we have a red shoe that women wear that is called heel because the heel of the feet of the foot is up. So that's what is called heel. Number eight, heel. H-E-A-L, heel. To make or become healthy again. The picture on the right, we have a sick person and after taking medicines, good care, sleep, and rest, she healed. She is all healed. She feels good again. Heal. Number nine, peak. P-E-A-K, peak. The top of a mountain. So we have here this huge mountain. And the very top part of the mountain is called the peak. Number 10, peak. P-E-E-K, peak. To glance or look quickly or secretly. We have a picture on the right, a person that is peeking through the window blind. And in the right, we have a girl that is supposed to have her eyes covered, probably for a surprise, but she decides to pick. So it's give just a quick look of something to pick. Number 11, scent. S-E-N-T, scent. Past tense and past participle of send. I sent a letter to my friends. I sent an invitation. So when you're writing on the chat, like WhatsApp chat, your message has been sent. Number 12, send. C E N T, sent a coin using the United States and Canada, and it worth one cent of a dollar. Number 13, scent. S-C-E-N-T, scent. A distinctive smell. We know the scent of a cookie. It smells like sweet, chocolatey, buttery, warm scent. We have, we know the scent of a, pla a flower. When you smell the rose, you know how the rose smells. It just have a, a peculiar scent that you identify, and we have the fragrances, the scents of, of perfumes. 
Number 14, ring. R-I-N-G, ring. A circular band that is worn on a finger or used to encircle something. Those in the picture are wedding rings. When um, we get married, we get we wear rings in our finger. Or you can wear rings for fun just because you want to ring a ring. Number 15, ring. W-R-I-N-G, ring. To twist or squeeze so as to force out liquid. For example, when you're drying and cleaning up the car, washing the car, when you dry it up, you have a, a wet towel that you wring in order to get rid of the water that it has in excess. Ring. Number 16, vein. V-A-I-N, vein, having no success. Look at this guy, this jump that he did, it's in vain. I mean, I mean the, the motorcycle is too small. Probably he did not take the right um, speed that he needed in order to jump all of, over these cars. So his jump is in vain. Also vain, it's a guy or a person that is just not a good looking, like yeah, they're in the street and um, not, not well fixed vain. A vain person. Number 17, vein. V-A-N-E, vein. A thin, flat piece of wood or metal, often having the shape of an arrow or a rooster that turns on a vertical pivot to show the direction of the wind. Uh, usually the veins are in uh, barns on the fields where um, people have animals. And, um, and they do have like crops, they grow crops. So it will indicate where the wind is blowing from and to, goes through. Number 18, vein, V-E-I-N, vein, a blood vessel through which blood returns to the heart. So it's inside our body and it's the one that is used to draw the blood out of your body when you need a medical exam or something. Number 19, minor, M-I-N-E-R, minor, a person who works in a mine. Um, we could find out mine of gold or coal or minerals. Mine is under the ground, mine. A miner works in a mine. And number 20, miner, M-I-N-O-R, miner, a person too young to take on the rights and duties, duties of an adult. You guys are a miner. You're under age. So you are a minor person. <laughs> 